this willful blindness? At the very least, the president may have completely out of step with the next day, even though the next day, this is announcing the Juneteenth Green holiday. I remind you that of what the president said about players peacefully protesting racial injustice. Wouldn't you love to see one of these NFL owners when somebody disrespects our flag? To say, get that son of a bitch off the field right now, out, he's fired. He's fired! This is a man who has been stoking racial division for years, decades, polarizing the country because he thinks it will help him at the polls. Don't forget this is a man who promoted the racist birth or lie that President Barack Obama was not born in this country. This is a president who said this about deadly white supremacist violence in Charlottesville. So had people that were very fine people on both sides. You had people in that group, excuse me, excuse me, I saw the same pictures as you did. This is a man who danced around the question of whether he disavowed David Duke. David Duke is a former leader of the Ku Klux Klan. He called African nations, sending immigrants to this country, quote, shithole countries. America is crying out for justice tonight. Can you hear it? Because this president refuses to hear it. In the face of all that, the president says he thinks that he is the one to unite us. But do his actions speak louder than his words? Caitlin Collins, Seth Herndon, weigh in.